My beloved child, I sense the immense burden on your shoulders, grappling with the challenges of restricted mobility and the isolating feeling of navigating through life alone. It's undeniably tough. The struggle of feeling confined, yearning for assistance that seems elusive that's a profound burden. It's no joke, feeling trapped and not having someone there to lend a hand when you need it most. I can feel your desire for a glimmer of hope, for a heroic figure to swoop in and lighten the load. In my cosmic strategy, I have a unique way of signaling when change is on the horizon. Hold on to your heart, because the suspense is about to hit the roof. Picture this. Someone's making a grand entrance, rolling up in a sleek, black car. But before moving forward, affirm your belief in God by commenting yes. Keep in mind our existence is influenced by what we receive, but the true meaning of life lies in what we give. A humble $40 contribution can offer sustenance for a child for several days. Are you ready? Prepare yourself, for what's approaching isn't merely a person arriving in a vehicle, it's the universe orchestrating the delivery of precisely what you need, even if it arrives from an unexpected source. Even amidst stagnation, the universe is actively concocting moments of transformation. Trust in this, assistance is on route, ready to extend a helping hand for you. It may not manifest in the manner you anticipate, but it will seamlessly integrate into your life like a missing puzzle piece. Therefore, cling to hope, anticipate a wave of kindness, and remain vigilant for support emerging from the most unforeseen avenues. That vehicle's arrival symbolizes more than transportation. It signifies a surge of hope, reassurance of companionship, and the imminent arrival of assistance. This arrival isn't just for show. It's hiding a secret, and the intrigue is off the charts. Get ready because you're diving deep into a tale that's about to unfold in the most unexpected way. Guess what's around the corner? Imagine a sleek black car pulling up, but it's more than just a set of wheels, it's a potent symbol. A sign that genuine help is en route, not just for a lift, but for authentic support and guidance. This arrival isn't merely about a vehicle. It's the universe delivering precisely what you need, even if it comes from an unforeseen direction. Even in moments of apparent stagnation, the universe is orchestrating these instances that usher in change. Take my word for it, there's someone or something making its way to you, poised to extend a helping hand. It may not unfold as you anticipate, but it's tailor-made to fit into your life seamlessly. Hold on to that hope, brace yourself for a dose of kindness, and keep your eyes peeled for assistance emerging from the most unexpected corners. The black car's arrival? It's more than just transportation. It's a surge of hope, a gentle reminder that you're not alone and support is on its way. Visualize the expansive cosmic canvas adorned with twinkling stars, akin to celestial diamonds, while the universe orchestrates a symphony of energies. Amidst this vastness, focus on a specific intersection where your life converges with the divine plan, accompanied by your guardian angels bearing a message of significance. Behold the emergence of a black car on the horizon, navigating through the twists and turns of your life's journey. This vehicle transcends mere transportation. It symbolizes an impending event of profound transformation. Your angels emphasize that this person's arrival with car is no mere coincidence, but a synchronicity meticulously arranged by the divine. The color black embodies mystery and the unknown signaling the depth of transformation that awaits. As the car symbolizes movement and journey, prepare to embrace the forthcoming event with openness and receptivity. It may manifest as a person, an opportunity, or a revelation, driving into your life with purpose on the cosmic highway. Anticipate the moment as the black car approaches, pulsating with cosmic energy and synchronized with celestial rhythms. Guided by your angels, be poised to welcome what unfolds as the car gracefully halts in the theater of your existence. As its doors open, a figure emerges, exuding an energy that resonates with your soul. 
transcending temporal and spatial confines. Whether a person, a mentor, or an opportunity, this arrival holds the key to a new chapter, a divine intervention poised to elevate your journey. Allow your consciousness to expand and your horizons to align with the higher purpose that awaits. Feel the energy surrounding this event, charged with the love and guidance of divine beings walking beside you. The figure stepping out of the black car serves as a messenger, a conduit of divine wisdom, and their presence is a gift from the universe. Open your heart to receive the blessings this arrival brings, knowing it may challenge, inspire, or lead you down unexpected paths. Understand that the unfolding of this event is a sacred process intricately woven into the fabric of your soul's journey. As the figure approaches, feel the energy exchange between your spirit and theirs, embracing the connection that holds the potential for profound growth and transformation. As the black car fades into the cosmic horizon, know that this moment is etched into the tapestry of your destiny. Embrace it with wonder and gratitude. For you stand on the brink of profound transformation, cheered on by angels by your side. The arrival from the black car promises new beginnings, spiritual growth, and a deeper connection to the divine. Remember, you are a beloved child of the universe, guided towards the path of light and love. Embrace the arrival with an open heart, trusting that the universe conspires to lead you to your highest destiny. Jesus assures you that the divine plan cannot be stopped, beckoning you towards a journey of faith and triumph. Amidst life's conflicts and storms, Jesus remains the unwavering beacon of hope in your life. This year, a divine promise unfolds before you, laden with blessings and prosperity. Draw strength from Jesus daily, cleanse your thoughts of despair, and embrace bravery in your faith. Nourish your soul with Jesus' teachings, clothe yourself in humility and patience, and watch as the garden of your life blooms with wondrous blessings. Remember the glory of your victories, forged through sacrifice and the power of resurrection. Jesus vows to be by your side in all moments, prosperous and challenging, guiding you as your watchful guardian and unwavering provider. In times of defeat, do not succumb to despair for you are never alone in Jesus' presence. My words are not empty. They are promises rooted in the depths of my being. Defeat holds no power over you, for you are enveloped in my steadfast embrace. Let your heart be a sanctuary of my assurances, for I dwell within you. Reject the whispers of doubt and lack, for I am the embodiment of capability, abundance, and existence. Face your adversaries with courage, knowing that I am your constant companion. My provision is abundant, and I am the source of your fulfillment. Listen to my guidance, obey, and march confidently towards your aspirations. Do not cast your eyes downward. Lift your gaze, for I guide you by the hand, shielding you from harm. I am your loyal friend, unwavering and true. I accept you wholly as you are sharing in your joys and pains, celebrating your victories, supporting you in triumph, and uplifting you in defeat. I extend my hand to you in times of need. I am Jesus, your Lord, ever-present and faithful. Fear not, for I am your friend. Do not lose heart or give your detractors the satisfaction of your downfall. Pursue your path for yourself, for your loved ones, but most importantly, in remembrance of my boundless love. Reflect on my journey from sorrow to the cross, undertaken out of love for your forgiveness, liberation, healing, and salvation. In your most challenging moments, I am with you, hand in hand. Commit to perseverance, and my unwavering presence will infuse you with strength, encouragement, peace, confidence, solace, wisdom, courage, and joy. Open your eyes to the future, to your dreams and desires planted within you. Expel doubt and disbelief from your heart, even in times of scarcity, uncertainty, and injustice. Remember that I have overcome the world, and you shall overcome trials. 
your brave and steadfast heart shall be ignited with the flames of joy and victory. You are a treasure of incomparable worth, radiating with the light of my love. Your soul emanates beauty, purity, and sincerity, mirroring my divine image. You are a reflection of me, a spark of my creation, infused with life breathed into you by my hand. Regardless of your origins, wealth, body, or others' perceptions, your value remains unchanged in my eyes. You are my beloved child, enveloped in boundless love, an heir to my blessings proclaimed loudly for all to hear. While the enemy may view you with trepidation, fearing my unwavering defense over you, I stand steadfast by your side. My word, vibrant and everlasting, infuses you with faith, consistently proving true. I await your bold step forward to claim the courage I have instilled in you. Fear not the shadows cast by your adversaries, for they hold no power against you. Choose to believe in me, for I have never destined you for failure but for greatness. My purpose is to raise you to great heights, to be a beacon of faith and wielder of my power. Stand firm in the tempests, armed with the power of my word, and envision yourself as a valiant warrior of holiness and wisdom, victorious and triumphant. Embrace and declare your inherent worth, for you are my cherished child, deeply loved and cherished. Confide in me, express your love and belief, for I yearn to hear it. Though sorrow may engulf you at times, understand that it is your heart resonating with my Holy Spirit, beckoning you back to me in the quiet of the morning. Often, the demands of the day entangle you, causing you to miss the moments to recall my presence. My spirit gently warns you against the emptiness creeping in, urging you to seek the living water that heals and replenishes your soul. If you find yourself feeling desolate and parched within, it's a sign that you've been away from my presence for too long. But know that I am not one to lie or forsake you. My love for you knows no bounds, demonstrated in countless ways. Draw near to me, and I will fill you with divine sweetness, nourishing you with love so profound that your tears will turn to tears of joy. I wish to heal and bless you, to manifest miracles and wonders in your life and within your family. My declarations for prosperity and hope are set and inscribed in eternity. Embrace peace and joy by believing in my word and freeing yourself from anxieties about the future. Despite the enemy's attempts to overpower you and dismiss your faith, stand tall and confront the hurdles with my word as your guide. Trust in me, for my power is boundless and I alone can lift you up. Your heart should swell with the courage and faith of a triumphant warrior, consistently emerging victorious despite arduous battles. Voice your love for me, raise your head high, and seek strength in my presence knowing that the good you seek will not be withheld. Trust in my provision, for I will grant you abundantly. You've implored healing for your ailments, and I reach out to cure you. You've wept for your children, pleading for their success and liberation from strife. I assure you personally that I will aid, deliver, and save them. Trust in my boundless love and power. My grace and mercy are yours for the taking. As you come to me with faith, each day becomes a celebration of the victory I bestow upon you. Approach your life with courage and joy, letting go of the fears that cloud your mind. Feel the embrace of my protection and deep love. Always remember, no matter the circumstance, you are never forsaken. Open your heart fully to embrace this truth. The past is behind you, and my love has reshaped you. You stand now as a rejuvenated soul, transformed in character. Your choice to believe in me has set you on the path to receive all the wonders I have in store for you. Your adversaries will watch in amazement, and your family will marvel at the transformation within you. Seize the chance to testify to the world how my love has reshaped you, renewed you, and guided you away from past conflicts and errors. In this life, you now stride with wisdom and patience on a new journey. 
Fear shall no longer be your companion, and you will not retreat or succumb to temptation. My remarkable power will infuse your life with strength and joy, and your very presence will exude happiness. You are deeply cherished, and my voice has reached you time and again. Now is the moment to trust in me with your whole heart. Your blessing is on the threshold. The day of your transformation is here, my child. I will raise you high like an eagle, soaring above mountains of distress and adversity. Above every storm, you will glide and find rest in my comforting embrace. I promise you tranquility and renewed vigor. Awakening to each new day, your vision will extend far beyond any obstacle. Like an eagle, you will understand that I have granted you spiritual wings to ascend and reach the heavens with your prayers. In times of trouble or danger, I will be your refuge and shield. I will come to you, your aid, and extend my mighty hand to protect you. I speak these words to you today so that you may live in joy and relish in all my blessings. In my love, your soul will be renewed, witnessing how I work in your surroundings, bringing change. My desire for you is nothing but the best, and I am the source of your daily strength, enabling you to rise higher and further from the troubles that once stole your peace and troubled your heart. On this dawning day, I bring a wave of tranquility into your life, standing against the tumultuous winds that whirl around you, calming the storms that seek to unsettle you. The sun shall rise at my command, casting light upon your path, guiding your way. You will stand tall and firm, like a mighty tree rooted deeply in fertile soil, as I steady your steps on. The journey toward triumph will shape you into an unyielding and robust being, unshakable by any adversity that dares to obstruct your way. Should you need to soar, I will endow you with wings. If you require resolve to confront a challenge, I will imbue you with unwavering strength. In moments of uncertainty, when you face difficulties, I will bless you with the wisdom needed to conquer and prevail in any circumstance. Today, I am here to rejuvenate your spirit, fortifying you to be stronger than stone, mightier than any giant you encounter. Your prayers are music to my ears. Your faith brings me immense pleasure. Witnessing your devotion each morning, dedicating time and space to me, fills me with immense joy. Your sincere offerings of respect, your petitions, praises, and worship are treasures to me. Your earnestness ignites my heart with wondrous delight. You are perfect in your authenticity, and your faith is pure. Though life has at times marred your self-perception, you now possess a heart of goodness true for my lips. You have faltered often, yet you have always returned to me in repentance, seeking another chance. It is this chance I joyfully extend to you each day. So, hold out your hand and trust in me. Imagine, if you will, a season as this, so filled with God's grace that every step forward is guided by His hand. Every challenge faced is an opportunity for growth, and every moment is steeped in the potential for miraculous change. As we greet each day of March, let us embrace it as a month rich with the potential for new beginnings and flourishing aspirations. It's a time to reflect on the profound spiritual journey ahead of us. This isn't just another month. It's a divine invitation to experience life-changing breakthroughs and blessings. Think of each day as a seed capable of sprouting into a testament of God's faithfulness. As the earth renews itself, so too can our spirits be rejuvenated, infused with fresh hope and new strength. This March, let's open our hearts to the possibilities of what faith, trust, and surrender to God's will can bring into our lives. If you believe that God can make a difference in your life this month, let us stand together in faith, believing that God will move mightily in our lives. Make listening to this prayer every day of this month a part of your daily routine as you build your faith while anticipating the blessings that God has in store for you. I am also going to pray a powerful prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. I in the gentle unfolding of the days of March. We are reminded of God's unwavering promise that He is continuously at work, 
ushering in new blessings into our lives that emerge as unexpectedly as the first blooms of spring. With the arrival of each morning, we are embraced by His unwavering mercies as fresh and invigorating as a new dawn. Isaiah 43 verse 19 reminds us, Behold, I will do a new thing, now it shall spring forth, shall you not know it? I will even make a road in the wilderness and rivers in the desert. This verse affirms God's continuous work in our lives. Alongside this, we are also comforted by Lamentations 3 verses 22 to 23, which assures us, saying, Through the Lord's mercies, we are not consumed because His compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. Let us hold these promises close to our hearts. Let them be the guiding light through each day of this month and beyond. My friends, as God unfolds a fresh chapter in your life this month, anticipate blessings beyond your imagination. Ephesians 3 verse 20 reminds us, Now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us. As we stand on the threshold of this new chapter, uplifted by the promise of divine blessings, let us also turn our hearts toward the horizon of breakthroughs. Just as we are encouraged by Ephesians 3 verse 20 to anticipate blessings beyond our imagination, let this assurance propel us into a realm where barriers are broken and limits are surpassed. In this sacred space of expectation, let us hold fast to the belief that with God, every moment is ripe with potential for transformation and victory. The concept of breakthrough is not just a fleeting wish, but a divine promise waiting to unfold in your life this month. Picture yourself standing before vast seas, with faith as your staff, ready to part the waters. The obstacle that once seemed insurmountable will become pathways to victory. Breakthroughs are born from moments of steadfast faith and unwavering trust in God's timing. Let this month be your moment of crossing over, leaving behind the wilderness and stepping into the promised land of your destiny. Joshua 1 verse 9 encourages us, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and of good courage. Do not be afraid, nor be dismayed, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. The month of March calls for a declaration of freedom and deliverance from every form of bondage and evil that has tried to hold you captive. Deliverance is God's hand extended in the darkest nights, His power setting you free from chains unseen. Like dawn breaking upon the night, God's light is ready to shatter the shadows, offering a way out where there seems to be none. Stand firm in your faith, for deliverance is not just a possibility. It is your inheritance as a child of God.my friends. As the earth breaks open to reveal the first signs of spring, so too can healing break through the hard ground of hurt and illness. Healing flows from the very heart of God, a balm for every wound and a remedy for every pain. This March, let hope rise within you like the springtime sun. Warming places that have been long cold and forgotten. God's desire is to see you whole, to mend what has been broken, and to restore what was lost. Embrace his healing touch, for it is as sure as the sunrise. Jeremiah 30 verse 17 tells us, For I will restore health to you and heal you of your wounds, says the Lord. As you navigate each day of this month, know that you are surrounded by God's safeguarding love and protection. Protection in this new month is as a fortress built around you a shield that no enemy can breach. The same God who watches over the sparrow is attentive to your every step, guarding you from seen and unseen dangers. Walk confidently into each new day, for you are covered by the Almighty Shadow, a place where fear cannot reside. Psalm 91 colon 4 reassures us, He shall cover you with His feathers, and under His wings you shall take refuge. His truth shall be your shield and buckler. My friends, the month of March stands as a beacon of hope, a testament to the enduring love and power of God at work in our lives. It's a time to sow seeds of faith and to expect a harvest of miracles. As the natural world around us bursts into life, let us also look for the signs of spiritual renewal and growth. Each day is a canvas painted with opportunities for blessings, breakthroughs, deliverance, healing, and protection. Let this month of March be your turning point, a period of extraordinary transformation that sets the tone for the rest of your year. With God by your side, there's no limit to what you can achieve. Philippians 4 verse 13 declares, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. This powerful assurance reminds us that with faith in Him, our possibilities are boundless. Remember, the same power that raised Christ from the dead is at work within you, 
ready to do immeasurably more than all you ask or imagine. March forward with courage, for you are destined for greatness, surrounded by God's blessings and favor. As we embrace the fullness of what March has to offer, let's do so with hearts open to the transformative power of God's love. Ready to receive the abundant life that He promises, let this month be a testament to His faithfulness. As we walk in the fullness of His blessings and breakthroughs, propelled by divine motivation towards the destiny He has ordained for us, not all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. And remember, you should also listen to this prayer each day of this month as you come in agreement and build your faith. It's a daily commitment to seeing God's hand move in every aspect of your life. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, the King of kings and Lord of lords, He who was and is and is to come, You are the Almighty and everlasting God, the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. I stand in awe of Your magnificent glory and power, acknowledging You as the Creator of all things and the Sustainer of life. Your greatness and majesty fill the heavens and the earth, and Your wisdom is unsearchable. You are worthy of all praise, and Your love endures forever. Lord, I come before you with a heart full of gratitude and praise. Thank you for your unfailing love, your boundless mercy, and the countless blessings you have poured into my life. Lord, thank you for the precious gift of life and for guiding me safely thus far. Your faithfulness has been my shield. Thank you for the promise of new beginnings, for the hope that springs eternal with the dawn of each day. May my heart always be attuned to your grace and goodness as I navigate the days ahead. Merciful Father, I confess my sins before you, those known and those hidden in the shadows of my heart. I ask for your forgiveness, and with a heart made free by your grace, I also forgive those who have trespassed against me. Lord, help me to release any harbored bitterness and resentment so that I may fully embrace the freedom found in forgiveness. God, I seek your guidance each day as I navigate the paths you have set before me and as I encounter the challenges of life. Enlighten my path with the light of your wisdom and lead me in decisions that align with your will. Grant me the discernment to recognize your voice amidst the noise of the world and the boldness to follow it without hesitation. In every situation, may your guiding hand be upon me, directing my journey towards paths of righteousness and peace. I, in the mighty name of Jesus, I declare that confusion and doubt will not derail my journey. Father, I stand firm in the belief that your wisdom will be my compass, guiding every step I take towards the destiny that you have ordained for me. Lord, I seek your provision in every aspect of my life, trusting that you will supply all my needs according to your riches and glory. Grant me the wisdom to steward your blessings wisely and the faith to believe for abundance in areas of scarcity. In your grace, open the doors of opportunity and pour out your provisions so I may reflect your generosity in my life. I pray for healing, Lord, in every part of my being. Heal my body from illness, mend my heart from brokenness, and restore my spirit from weariness. I stand firm on your promises of healing and restoration, and with faith, I claim complete healing in the mighty name of Jesus. Let your divine healing power flow through every cell of my body, rejuvenating my mind, heart, and soul. As I receive your healing, let it be a testimony of your unfailing love and compassion not just in my life, but also in the lives of my loved ones who are in need of your touch. I, in the name of Jesus, I rebuke and bind every form of bondage and declare deliverance over my life. I declare that every chain of addiction, fear, and any form of oppression is broken in the name of Jesus. I rejoice in the freedom that comes from your saving grace, knowing that whom the sun sets free is free indeed. May your hand guide me, bringing breakthroughs even in the barren areas of my life. Lord, I ask for your divine protection to be a shield around me and my loved ones. Guard us from the schemes of the enemy, from dangers seen and unseen. In the powerful name of Jesus, I rebuke every attack aimed to harm us, trusting that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. Your faithfulness is our armor and protection, and under your wings we find refuge. Lord, as I say this prayer together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is opening before you right now. Almighty God, you are the rock of our salvation. We come in agreement seeking your face, asking for your hand to move mightily in our lives. Bless us, Lord, with your holy presence, fill us with your spirit, and lead us into a deeper relationship with you. 
Together we claim victory over our challenges, we declare healing over our bodies and minds, and we celebrate the peace and joy found in your love. Merciful Father, we stand against the spirit of poverty and lack in our lives, and we welcome the spirit of prosperity and abundance. I in the name of Jesus, we declare that we are blessed to be a blessing. And as vessels of your blessings, we become channels through which your abundance flows to enrich others. We pray for divine wisdom and discernment in every decision we face. Lead us by your Spirit to walk in paths of righteousness. Shield us from deception and guide us into all truth. Grant us understanding and clarity to navigate life's challenges. Open our spiritual eyes to recognize the hidden traps and snares of the enemy and bestow upon us the wisdom to avoid them. Heavenly Father, we come before you seeking your divine protection over our relationships and interactions. Guard us from toxic relationships, manipulative individuals, and those who intend to cause harm. Surround us with the warmth of godly friendships, the wisdom of mentors, and the counsel of advisors who will uplift us on our faith journey. Bestow upon us the discernment to gracefully navigate the complexities of different personalities and relationships while we maintain a posture of love, grace, and forgiveness towards all. Almighty God, we call upon your strength and power to help us stand firm against the wiles of the enemy. In unity, we resist every temptation and commit to walking obediently according to your word. Protect us from the unseen battles of spiritual warfare. May your host of angels encamp around us, guarding our every step. We seek your divine protection over our words and actions, that we may be vessels of life, sources of encouragement and edification to those we encounter. In the name of Jesus, we declare that we are protected in our comings and goings. We declare that everything is working for us and not against us. We are grateful, Lord, for the assurance that your goodness and favor will be with us every step of the way. Let your peace that surpasses all understanding carry us through this month. We thank you for all that you have done and for all that you are about to do. Let your will be done in our lives as it is in heaven, for yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Have you ever felt the tranquility of early morning when the world is hushed and the day brims with potential? This moment, so serene and pregnant with promise, resembles commencing our day with prayer. Just as the dawn's light begins to blanket the sky, dispelling darkness, initiating our day with God illuminates our path, guiding us through whatever lies ahead. Prioritizing prayer as the first action of our day isn't just about the words we utter. It's about forging a connection with our Creator. It's about offering our time, thoughts, and hearts to Him before anything else. Today, we delve into the significance of making prayer the inaugural act of our day, exploring how this simple yet profound practice can influence the course of our day, impact our mood, and shape our interactions with others. When we start our day with prayer, we declare to God, you are the most important part of my day. This act of prioritizing God sets the tone for everything that follows, affirming our faith and trust in Him. It's a practice that not only strengthens our faith, but also enriches our daily lives, infusing them with peace, joy, and purpose. Commencing each morning with conversation with God is more than just a ritual. It's a lifeline, anchoring our souls in the certainty of His love and promises. It establishes a precedent for the rest of the day, offering a perspective aligned with God's will and brimming with hope. Morning prayer isn't merely a routine. It's an act of faith, believing that God hears us, cares for us, and is actively involved in our lives. It's an expression of our dependence on Him, acknowledging that we need His wisdom and strength to navigate the day. Moreover, starting our day with God empowers us to embody the fruits of the Spirit, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. These qualities become more evident in our lives when we spend time with God each morning, enriching our relationships and allowing us to become vessels of His love. Morning prayer equips us with wisdom for the day's decisions, guiding us in both major choices and everyday matters. It sets a rhythm of communion with God that can continue throughout the day, transforming ordinary moments into opportunities to experience His presence and work in our lives. The practice of starting our day with God through prayer is a journey of faith, trust, and surrender. It promises not just a good day, but a God-centered life, rich in peace, purpose, and joy. Let's commit to making prayer the first action of our day.
inviting God's presence into every moment and allowing His will to shape our lives. Morning prayer reminds us that true peace is found in the presence of God. Let us, therefore, cherish these early moments with God, allowing His peace to fill us and flow through us. May it be a guiding light throughout our day, a reminder of God's constant presence and unwavering love. In doing so, we not only enrich our own lives, but also extend this peace to those around us, creating ripples of God's love in a world in desperate need of His peace. Embarking on each new day with morning prayer not only immerses us in peace, but also fortifies us with a strength that is not our own. This strength, bestowed upon us by the Almighty, is a testament to the power that lies in beginning our day rooted in divine communion. It is a strength that surpasses physical capabilities, nurturing our inner resilience and empowering us to face life's challenges with courage and determination. This divine strength is a promise from God to those who seek Him, as vividly captured in Isaiah 40 verse 31. But those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Morning prayer is our act of waiting on the Lord, of dedicating the first fruits of our day to Him. And in return, He renews our strength, equipping us to soar above the trials and tribulations of life. The strength we gain from starting our day in God's presence goes beyond mere endurance. It transforms our perspective on adversity. Challenges become opportunities to witness God's power at work in our lives. Trials become platforms for His grace to be displayed, and weaknesses become conduits for His strength to be perfected. This strength enables us to persevere with joy, knowing that our victory is secured in Christ. Furthermore, the strength derived from morning prayer infuses our faith with vitality. It anchors us in the truth of God's word and promises, fortifying our trust in Him. In moments of doubt or fear, the remembrance of our morning encounters with God serves as a beacon of hope, reminding us of His faithfulness and the unshakable foundation upon which our lives are built. Also, the strength we receive from morning prayer prepares us for spiritual warfare. Armed with the full armor of God, we can stand against the schemes of the enemy, secure in the knowledge that the battle belongs to the Lord. Our morning prayers act as a declaration of our dependence on God, activating His power and protection over our lives. In essence, the strength gained from our daily communion with God is multifaceted, touching every area of our lives. It is a strength that does not boast in its own might, but in the power of the one who promises to be our refuge and strength and ever-present help in trouble. As we continue to prioritize morning prayer, let us do so with the expectation of being filled anew with God's indomitable strength, ready to face whatever the day may hold with confidence and grace. In the scriptures, we find compelling stories of individuals whose lives were profoundly shaped by their commitment to putting prayer first. These biblical characters offer us timeless examples of how starting the day with God can lead to divine guidance, protection, and empowerment in fulfilling God's purposes. Their stories encourage us to make prayer the first action of our day, trusting that like them, we will experience God's guidance, protection, and empowerment to fulfill our divine calling. As we follow in their footsteps, let us remember that our prayers, whether in times of joy, uncertainty, or distress, are always heard by a God who is intimately involved in the details of our lives. Let us first seek God in prayer, laying the foundation of our journey in His presence. This divine attentiveness assures us of His unwavering support and guidance. It beckons us to approach Him with confidence, knowing that each prayer plants the seeds for miracles yet unseen. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, Almighty God, I come before you in awe of your majesty and grace. You are the creator of the heavens and the earth, the King of kings and Lord of lords. Your power is infinite, your wisdom beyond understanding, and your love for us everlasting. You are worthy of all honor, all glory, and all praise. I thank you, Lord, for the gift of life and for your mercies that are new every morning. We are thankful for this new day, a fresh opportunity to experience your love, to walk in your ways, and to reflect your light to those around us. Thank you for your faithfulness and for your unfailing love that surrounds me and my loved ones. Lord, I am grateful for your daily provisions and blessings. In your presence, there is fullness of joy, and at your right hand, there are pleasures forevermore. 
Merciful Father, I acknowledge my sins before you and ask for your forgiveness. I also choose to forgive those who have trespassed against me, releasing any bitterness or resentment, for you have called us to live in freedom and peace. Lord, I come to you seeking to start each day in your presence, to lay the foundation of my day upon your word and prayer. Help me to seek you first, trusting that all I need will be added unto me, as you have promised. I ask that you would guide my steps, direct my paths, and fill me with your wisdom. In the name of Jesus, I declare that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. I rebuke and bind every plan of the enemy to disrupt my peace, steal my joy, or derail my purpose. In the name of Jesus, I bind every spirit of confusion, fear, worry, anxiety, and discouragement. Father, I ask for your protection over me and my loved ones. Shield us from the attacks of the enemy and surround us with your angels. I ask for your healing hand upon us, believing for restoration and strength in our bodies. Lord, bless us in our coming and going, and let your blessings and favor rest upon us as we walk through this day. Let us be vessels of your love and grace to others. As I say this prayer together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is opening before you right now. We come in agreement as we pray for each other, asking for your Holy Spirit to fill us afresh, to empower us to live lives that glorify you. Guide us, Lord, in your wisdom. Protect us in your strength. Heal us in your mercy and bless us with your abundance. We claim victory over every challenge, declare healing over every illness, and give thanks for your provision and protection. Let your kingdom come and let your will be done on earth and in our lives as it is in heaven. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forevermore. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Now, for those who are listening and you want to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, I urge you to receive God's grace with an open and repentant heart. Start where you are. Your past doesn't matter. Jesus came to seek and to save those who are lost. God loves you. It is not God's will that anyone should perish, but for all to come to repentance. Say this simple salvation prayer for yourself. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I am a sinner and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I turn from my sins and invite you to come into my heart and life. I want to trust and follow you as my Lord and Savior. Lord Jesus, hear my prayer. I pray. Thank you, Lord, for saving me. Amen. Now that you have prayed this prayer, you can ask a pastor to baptize you at a local church and make that decision public. Baptism is a symbol of that decision to follow Jesus. Then. I encourage you to have fellowship with other believers, to learn more about your new life, and to get to know more about God. Please feel free to leave your prayer requests in the comment section so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory. Also, we invite other believers on the YouTube platform and all over the world to join us and start praying for you right now. And we want you to know that even if you don't see a reply to your prayer request, it doesn't mean that you were not prayed for. Rest assured that we are actively lifting up each request to God that is in accordance with His will. We believe in the power of prayer to bring comfort, healing, and guidance in accordance with God's perfect plan. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.